The national anthem sung by a woman who is on crack. How fitting she wears a white dress. I'm proud for her recovery, though. Demi, you're doing amazing. First and 10 from the 14. Tony Pollard took three pills of Cialis, refuses to go down, fights his way into the end zone for the Dallas Cowboys touchdown. Zeke, who? We got the best offensive line in the league, and we got Dick. Amari uh, Cooper, we them boys, we never gonna lose in the preseason again. Literally, on the very next play, give me back my ball. It's intercepted by the Dallas Cowboys. That's what we do, baby. Don't ever try to take our ball, because we always gonna take our stuff back. We them boys, nobody gonna stop us now. Cooper Rush takes the snap with them boys. He's got Devin Smith participating in the 10 toes down challenge for the Dallas touchdown. And they take the lead. Yeah, baby, it don't matter who play quarterback, running back, or wide receiver, we never gonna lose again. We them boys! Down to the land of them boys. Dick takes the snap, steps up in the pocket, he's looking towards his left. Little Nas once said he takes his horse to the Old Town Road so he can ride till it can't no more. What a horse can't ride if it can't gallop, as he'd find Michael Gallup in the end zone. Touchdown, Dallas. Yeah, baby, when I tell you, we got Dick. Somebody better pay Zeke. Amari Cooper, Van Der Esch. We just paid Jalen Smith. We them boys. We quick, Snorlax, use block. The punts blocked by Dallas. Clearly this man is not a graduate of Michael Sam University. He cannot recover balls at all. Oh wait, he did recover it in the end zone. Maybe he is a graduate of Michael Sam University. Touchdown, Dallas! Yeah! Our special teams is good too. But don't forget, on offense we get thick. We gonna pay deep. Amari Cooper, Jason Witten is back. And on defense, Van Der Esch. We pay Tank Lawrence. We also pay Jalen Smith. Byron Jones, we gotta pay him. But we them boys! Boys, we going to the Super Bowl. I just want to make sure everybody know that the deck attack is real. Oh no, the pass is intercepted. It's picked off by the Dallas Cowboys. Woo! With them boys. Did you hear Deck talking? It's because Deck was talking. Our defense made a play. We getting it done on offense, defense, and special teams, baby. We them boys. Nobody going to stop us now. Joe Flacco while in the land of them boys. Mike White takes the snap, rolling towards his right. He's got Jordan Dunn, who'd go into the end zone. Whoa, for the Dallas Cowboys touchdown. The Jeffrey Dahmer, Nick Rafilia talent is happening down here in Dallas because the Houston Texans may be dead, but they're still getting fucked. We them boys. We got Dick. We better pay Dick. I'm a recouper. We them boys. We go into the Super Bowl. With your Crips in the Sioux Whoop Zone, bum-ass Eli, I'm the fifth best athlete in my family. Manning would find Evan Ingram in the end zone. The Giants strike blood first. They may have scored first, but it don't matter. Our offense coming back on the field, and we gonna respond. Because we got Dick, we got Dick, Amari Cooper, we them boys. Back to the land of them boys. Dick takes the snap, looks over the middle. He's got Jarwin. Somebody must have unplugged the Giants controllers. How was nobody around him? Touchdown, Cowboys! What I tell you, what I tell you, we got Dick, he's elite, touchdown, we them boys. To the land of them boys, Dick, fake to Dick, headed towards his right, he's got Dick, and we're in, in the end zone, the retired old man scores, the Cowboys take the lead. Yeah, what I tell you, you can't step our offense, we got Dick, we got Dick. Amari Cooper, Jason Witten, don't forget about Randall Cobb. We got Blake Darwin, Jerry Jones, Jason Garrett, and we got everybody clicking on all cylinders. We them boys. We going to the Super Bowl. The land of them boys. Dick takes the snap, looking towards his left. He's got Amari Cooper in the end zone. Dallas takes a two possession lead. We can't be stopped. What I tell you, on a stoppable offense, we get Dick. We got Zeke, Amari Cooper, Jason Witten. We the best NFC East champs. We them boys. We go into the Super Bowl. To the lands of them boys. Dick play action fake to Zeke over the middle. It's Randall Cup for the Cowboys touchdown. The Giants got less defense than a James Harden basketball course. Let's go, baby. I told you, we them boys. Our offense can't be stopped. Why? Because we got Zeke. We got Zeke. Amari Cooper, Randall Cobb, Jason Witten, Troy Aikman on commentary, Tony Romo on commentary, Michael Urban, the analyst, Kip Bayless, we them boo!
boys. And if the East Temp, we going undefeated. Then we go into the Super Bowl. Nobody gonna stop us now. To the land of Finn boys. Thick hands the ball to Thick. He fight his way through two giants. Go into the end zone. The Cowboys would continue the Jeffrey Dahmer necrophilia challenge in Dallas. Cause the Giants may be dead. But they're still getting fucked. You wanna know why? Cause we them boys. We got Thick. We got Thick. Amari Cooper, Dathan Witten, Tony Romo on commentary, Troy Aikman on commentary, Michael Irvin the analyst, Skip Bayless, we eat them boys, Will Kane, we can't forget Will Kane, we going 16 and oh, going into the postseason, then we gonna go 3 and oh, and we gonna hoist up the Lombardi Trophy for the 6th time, nobody's gonna stop us now, we winning the Super Bowl, back to our nation's capital, Dick takes the snap, he'd connect with Amari Cooper, who'd go into the end zone, and Dallas extends their lead, what I tell you, it don't matter if the other team score first, we go come back, and they never gonna stop us, cause we got Dick, we got Zeke, Amari Cooper, Jason Witten, Randall Cobb, Skip Bayless, Troy Aikman on commentary, Tony Romo on commentary, Skip Bayless an analyst, Troy Aikman on commentary, I say it two times because we there boys, let's inside the five, Thick would hand the ball to Thick, he'd go into the end zone for a Dallas Cowboy touchdown, yeah baby, when I tell you, we two and oh, nobody gonna stop us, we gonna win the NFC East, then we gonna win the playoff, then we gonna win the Super Bowl, and we gonna be the six time champs, why, cause we got thick, we got thick, Amari Cooper, Jason Witten, Randall Cobb, Leighton Van Der Esch, Jalen Smith, Tank Lawrence, Byron Jones, we them boys, Tony Romo on commentary, Troy Aikman on commentary, Skip Bayless an analyst, Michael Irvin an analyst, we them boys, nobody gonna stop us now, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, Think fast, Thick takes the snap, he's got Amari, Armani, exchange Cooper in the end zone for his second touchdown on the day, the Cowboys extend their lead. Best quarterback in the league, best receiver in the league, Dick attack, Coop is back, we them boys, nobody can stop us now, to the land of them boys, Thick with a play action pick to Thick, he's gonna run it into the end zone for the Dick attack, Cowboys touchdown. You thought the Dallas Cowboys was gonna lose to the Dolphins? Are you dumb? Are you stupid? We're that boys! We're that boys! And the necrophilia begins down in the land of them boys because the Dolphins may be dead. But somehow, they're still getting fucked. What I tell you, we 3 and oh now, baby. We got 13 more regular season games to go. Then we got three in the playoffs. Then we go win the Super Bowl. Why? Because we got Dick. We got Zeke. Amari uh, Cooper. Jason Witten. Randall Cobb. Van Der Esch. Jalen Smith. Demarcus Lawrence. Byron Jones. Skip Bayless on TV, Troy Aikman on commentary, Tony Romo on commentary, Michael Irvin an analyst, we them boys, we gon' win it all, we go into the Super Bowl, six rings, six rings, six wings, six wings, six wings, six wings, third and four for them boys, Dick takes the snap, he connect with Vietnam War veteran Jason Witten, who's got butter fingers, can't hold on to the football, he fumbles on a play, it's recovered by the New Orleans Saints, they'd return it all the way back to the 40 yard line. Maybe I should have stayed on commentary, no no, it's no problem, you can make a mistake, we still them boys, we gon' come back, cause we got thick. We can't think, Murray Cooper, we go into the Super Bowl. The Cowboys now in the red zone. Rosetta Stone English, motherfucker. As Thick would go into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown, they take the lead. Yeah, would I tell you, everything good comes with patience. We them boys! Here come the Cowboys, baby. Thick takes the... Shit. What are we doing? We them boys! Get it together, guys. Fun Hail Mary attempt. Thick going deep. He's got. No, 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 no. 
it don't matter if we don't go undefeated. We going on a 12 game winning streak, 15 and 1. Here we come, why? Cause we got thick, we got thick. Oh, Mari Cooper, Jason Witten, Randall Cobb, Van Der Esch, Jalen Smith, Demarcus Lawrence, Byron Jones, Skip Bayless the analyst, Tony Romo on commentary, Troy Aikman on commentary, Jerry Jones, it don't matter if we go 15 and 1, we gonna be the best team ever, winning the NFC East, we the fight! We coming for the Super Bowl! Six rings all the way! The Packers in the Funine in colored zone. Rosetta Stone finish, motherfucker, as A.A. Jones goes into the end zone for his second touchdown on the day. It's only 14 point gate. We still got hope. Let's go back 45 more minutes. We go win the game! Pick takes the snap. Did you know in Texas, peach season is something that's very desired? Well, Dak loves peaches. He also loves to make peach turnovers! The pass is intercepted by Sullivan, and the Packers take over again! No, 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 no! Stop them! Somebody do something! Evidently, the Cowboys are caught in some sort of Inzanami Genjutsu. They can't seem to stop the same result because A.A. Ron Jones finds his way into the end zone for his third touchdown on the day. Come on, defense! Jalen Smith, man, the end zone lead, Dak Lawrence, Byron, do, do something! We can't be down 24-0! Back to the lander. Them boys, Dak would hand the ball to think he fight his way into the end for the Dallas Cowboys touchdown. Uh, 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 stay in the life, stay in the life. Uh, 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 stay in the life, stay in the life. We're the point. We coming back, baby. To the land of them boys. Dick takes the snap, floats up a beautiful pass to Amari Cooper. He tell one pack of defender, get your bitch ass over me. Beyblade, let it rip. He'd go into the end zone. Touchdown, Cowboys. They cut their deficit to 10. Yeah, baby. Dick attack. Zeke is back, Coop make your defense look like poop, we never gonna step, we them boys! Green Bay on their heels, trying not to squander a 28 point lead, Rodgers got nobody open, he's sacked by Jalen Smith, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, we taking a receipt to the sperm bank cause we getting our comeback, deck attack, Zeke is back, Coop go make your poop, a defense elite! We them boys! Damn, I look like a Lego police officer. Darnold takes the snap. He'd connect with Griffin, and you could call him a Siamese fish, an Irish fit Finley, because he loves to fight. To go into the end zone, the Jets take a 21-3 lead. Back-to-back -back weeks, the Cowboys face a three-score deficit. No! What's happening with our elite defense? We got Van Der Esch, Jalen Smith, Thorn Lee, Demarcus Lawrence, Byron Jones with the offense. We got Dick, Zeke, Amari Cooper, Jason Witten, even Tony Romo's on commentary. How are we losing? Has the Jets driving on third and five? He's intercepted. Holy smokes, the Cowboys made a play. It'd be returned to the 25. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Here we come. Here we come. We them boys. We them boys. Oh, man, I'm on the side of Dallas. Dick would hand the ball to Dick. He'd fight his way into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Dick would give it to Dick. We got the Dick attack. Dick is back. Nobody gonna stop us. Call me queen. Cause easy come, easy go. Dallas going to the Super Bowl. Dallas in striking distance looking for the comeback dick would go on the attack and go into the end zone cowboys touchdown they pull within two take a take take a take they can stop the take a take oh but take a take take a take they can stop the take a take we coming back all the momentum in the hands of the cowboys prescott takes the snap looking over the middle for witten try so
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hold My Nugget Studios for your 2019 NFL Week 7 primetime game. Highlight comments every week. Start out in Dallas. Put our fingers. Dallas Goddard doing his best impersonation of a Mandingo warrior doing planks because he put his balls on the floor. Fumble on the plate recovered by their boy. That's what I like to see. Speaking of Orlando Scandrick, is he still with Dre and Michelle? That quarters in wanton wench said your wholeness can be deleted. I swear harlots say the damnedest things. But Tavon Austin went into the end zone for a damn boys touchdown. I don't think I'm considered a hoe no more. I don't really got no nobody in the last like two or three years. She said no more. <laughs> no, your whole your wholeness can get deleted. Your wholeness can get deleted. Your wholeness can get deleted. What? Your wholeness can get deleted. You remind me of a jackass. And I thought they said Cowboys fans were dumb. That's why we got rid of Orlando Scandrick a few years ago. Because he was affiliating with stupid people. How can you say your wholeness can be deleted? Kim Kardashian used to be a hoe. She may not be a hoe right now, but her history of hoeing is still on the record. Wholeness can't be deleted. That's stupid. You know who else is stupid? All 31 other teams in the NFL. Because they don't got deck. They don't got deck. They not them boys. We go into the Super Bowl. Meanwhile, on the ensuing Philly possession, call Come here. Shit. Gotcha, bitch. No. I call my strip sack on the play, recovered by the Cowboys. <laughs> on the very next play, hey, Malcolm Jenkins, you ever drove a Ford pickup truck? Ezekiel Elliott would feed him a shoulder pad, go into the end zone for the Cowboys touchdown. But upon further review, turns out he was down by contact at the one-yard line. They may have erased the touchdown, but they did not erase the trucking of Malcolm Jenkins. Very next play, the Eagles defense don't seem like they're hungry for shoulder pads. So Zeke would jump into the end zone. Touchdown, Cowboys. Two-touchdown lead. We them boys. We not losing more games. We them boys. NFC East chance. We them boys. Super Bowl, here we come. We them boys. To the land of them boys. Second and nine. Dick would find Randall Corn on the cob. He carry it to the one and on the very next play. Thick play action fake. He'd find Blake Jarwin wide open. It appears the entire Eagles defense did not consider this man a threat. Touchdown, Cowboys. Yeah. Take a tick. Take a tick. Following the Eagles turnover, the Dallas Cowboys are taking a dead Namekian to the morgue. Because they're looking to put the nail in the coffin. Dick would call his own number, dial up voicemail, go into the end zone. Dallas takes a 27-point lead. Let's go, baby. We got Dick. We got Zeke. Amari Cooper, Van Der Esch, Jalen Smith, Demarcus Lawrence, Tony Romo on commentary, Troy Aikman on commentary, Skip Bayless, the analyst, Jerry Jones. We didn't buy The Eagles never going to step us. We can went to the super poop. The Jeffrey Dahmer necrophilia challenge would not stop for the Philadelphia Eagles because they may be dead. But somehow, they were still getting fucked as they would lose by 27. Cry, Eagles, cry on the way to misery. Cry, Eagles, cry. The Cowboys give you the D. Cry, Eagles, cry. You ain't it. When will you see? Cry, Eagles, cry. Them boys with an alarm body. D E M D O Y S. We them boy. Uh, 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 uh. Cry, Eagles, cry. Cry, Eagles, cry. I, you thought you would come and get the dub. But Carson Wentz is a fucking scrub. Cry, Eagles, cry, go home, bitch. Aldrich Rosas connects on a 25-yard field goal. The Giants take a nine-point lead. How are we losing to these bums? Let's go! We them boys! We got thick! We got thick! Get it together! Into the defender. Dick takes the snap. He tells the Giants Patrick, get away from me. Rolling towards his right. He's got Blake Jarwin, who's got nothing but space. Like he moved into a new apartment. He dive into the end zone. Touchdown. Cowboys, they cut their deficit to two. Now that's what I'm talking about. We them boys. Dick takes the snap. Looking right. He's got Michael Gallup. He turned a defender into a Goomba. 
and go into the end zone for the Cowboys touchdown. We did, boys. They cannot stop us. They can. We did, boys. Thick takes the snap, looking over the middle. He's got Armani. Armani exchange Cooper. He'd make one giant plant his toes into the turf as he'd go into the end zone. Dallas takes a 30 to 18 lead. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. If you guys are supposed to be giants, we can call ourselves David. All we do is beat you guys. The Vikings in the cross. Hom colored zone. Rosetta Stone Heimer, motherfucker. As Kirk family member Cousins looking into the end zone, he's got Kyle Rudolph, the red zone reindeer. For their second hookup on the day, the Vikings take a 14 0 lead. No, 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 no. Darren Jones, Tank Lawrence, Van Der Eth, Stone Lee, Jalen Smith. You guys gotta play better. We're supposed to beat them boys. Let them down on defense. We're supposed to go to the Super Bowl. Two plays later, Dallas would take a visit to Cinnabar Island, not to get burned, but to take a look at Blaine's Rapidash, because Michael Gallup would gallop his way into the end zone like a horse and cut the deficit down to seven. Yeah, we finally on the board. Here we go, baby. Hot, hot. Fuck. A Viking jumped off sides. I heard he don't got good feet. I heard he got corns. On the Cobb, that is. As Randall Cobb would catch a pass in the end zone, Dallas would even up the score at 14 apiece. Ha <laughs> ha ha. You took your foot off the gas pedal. Gas pedal. We them boys. We got thick. We got thick. Amari Cooper. Randall Cobb. Blake Jarwin. Jason Witten. Tony Romo on commentary. Troy Aikman on commentary. We them boys. We coming back. We gonna win the game. Game, win the NFC East, and then we go into the Super Bowl. Nobody's going to stop us now. And Bailey from 27 yards out kicks it through the uprights, and it's good. Whoop de do. It don't matter if Dan Bailey make back-to-back -back kicks. Back when he was with the Cowboys, I remember his last year. He sucked. We them boys, we don't need him anyway. The Dallas Crips in the Sioux Whoop zone. Dak Prescott rolling towards his right. He's got Amari Armani exchange. Cooper participating in the 10 toes down challenge once again. Dallas takes the lead. You've been hit by, you've been hit by a smooth Needless to say, Amari Cooper doesn't get taken advantage of in his relationships because he finds a way to put his foot down. That's what I'm talking about! We got the lead! We got thick! We got Zeke! Amari Cooper! Ten toes down challenge champion! With them boys! We go with the NFC East, then we gonna go to the Super Bowl and win the Super Bowl! With Tony Romo on commentary! With them boys! Alexander Madison would get the handoff, activate his dreadlock powers, run through a couple of cowboys, go into the end zone for a Vikings touchdown. No, no, his butt touched the floor. Look at the replay. Well, I'll be damned, SpongeBob, you're right. His gluteus maximus minimus and cleft touchdown at the one yard line. The call would be reverse. Kirk family member Cousins looking towards his right and Kyle Rudolph, the red zone reindeer, would tell him two for your mistakes. 28 to 21 lead. Oh my God, we literally just had the lead. Dick takes the snap, look and left the pass broken up turnover on downs no 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 the game's not over we still got three timeouts we still can stop them to the land of them boys fourth and one game on the line Dak stepping towards his right he'd heave it in the land of them boys and the pass is gonna be Give me that. finally somebody's hands work the pass is intercepted by the vikings they're gonna win oh god damn it Jeff Driscoll would dial up voicemail, call his own number, go into the end zone. The Lions regain the lead. Oh, so you want to go back and forth with us? It's only a minute of time before we score and take the lead. Because we didn't boy. Hey, look, Jeff Driscoll's still out there fighting. He take the snap. Look over the middle. He's got Alien. Marvin Jones, who tell one Cowboys defender, get your bitch ass off me. Goes into the end zone for the Lions touch ya. But did this help them come back and win, though? Absolutely not. Ha, ha, ha. You guys can score all you want. The game's already done. Decided. We the boys! We never gonna lose! Cowboys. Four minutes left to play. Thick throwing it over the middle. He's got his man in the end zone for the Cowboys touchdown. And they'd head to the Thanksgiving table. They'd take out their Uno cards. They look to give the Bills two for their mistakes. And Dak would find old man Witten. 
but did this help them come back and win? Absolutely not. They'd fail to recover the onside kick, and the Bills would run out the clock, and Dallas lose their third consecutive game. Oh, no. Do you know how many teams we beat this season that has a winning record? But we supposed to beat them boys. We supposed to be elite. We supposed to go to the playoffs. So why is it every time we play against a team with a winning record, our W column is filled with zero? I just don't understand. We got thick. We got thick. Amari oh, Cooper. But every time we play a team over 500, our W column stays with zero. I don't care what nobody say. All right, you can put me on the L train, but we still gonna go to the playoffs. It don't matter if you see us in a glad commercial. That don't mean that we trash, cause we still got thick. We still got Zeke, Amari Cooper, Van Der S, Skip Bayless, Tony Romo on commentary, Troy Aikman on commentary, Michael Irvin an analyst. We still them boys. We go into the Super Bowl and we go get six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings. Six rings. Nobody's gonna stop us after this week. How about them cowboys? <laughs> but I'm just looking around. I'm looking around. I'm looking for anybody that picked the Cowboys. I'm looking for anybody out there that said the Cowboys is gonna win. I'm looking for all those Cowboy fans everywhere. It's the day after Thanksgiving. And I'm quite sure they're not happy today. Keep up alive, though. Keep up alive. Somehow, some way, we're going to get it done. We're going to get it done. That's what y'all been telling that old dude, Stephen A., didn't you? But it ain't going to happen. I'm so sorry. I actually wanted to wait until Christmas to break this news to you. Unfortunately, the Dallas Cowboys beat me, too. <laughs> you lose. Think fast. Watson takes the snap over the middle, connects with DeAndre Hopkins. We got some dreadlocks on dreadlocks violence as he pick up the first down against Stephon Gilmore. Wait a minute. How did he get a catch against Gilmore? I thought Amari Cooper was the best receiver in the league. What's happening? Hey, get out of here, Cowboys fans. This ain't about you. The Dallas Crips now in the Suwoop zone. Thick hands the ball to Thick, and he goes into the end zone and caps off a near 9-minute, 17-play, 75-yard drive with a Dallas 2-yard touchdown. Yeah, baby! It's too easy! We them boys! The Ursarangs looking to even up the score on a 7-play, 50-yard drive. Trubisky rolling towards his left. He's got a man. Wahoo! But he plays for the other team. Initially, the referee said it was an incomplete pass, but Chlamydia clap poppy Jason Garrett says, oh, no, let's challenge that shit. And Jordan Lewis was participating in the 10 toes down challenge and indeed intercepted the ball. That's what I'm talking about. Get the call right next time, ref. Mitch, I'm not a bitch. Trubisky takes the snap. Looking over the middle. Rifles the ball to Allen Robinson. Touchdown, Bears. They go up by 10. Homie out here looking like Brett Favre on this drive. Jalen Smith really out here took the football acting like he caught an interception. Look at the replay. Robinson already had possession. How are you going to take it away after they already deemed it a touchdown? No means no, Jalen. No means no. Come on, Gaith. Fight back! What the hell are we doing? I haven't seen this much dysfunction in America's team since the Civil War in my youth. This some old bullshit! Get it together! Where's my Ben Gay? God damn it, somebody get me my Ben Gay! On the ensuing drive, there'd be a mugging. Gengar! Use TM46 Thief! Butterfingers fumble on a play recovered by Jalen Smith. The Cowboys have life. Exactly what the doctor ordered. Fourth and one. Thiek goes into the end zone and they cut their deficit to ten. Yee! That's what we needed. That's what we needed. Then on second and one, two plays later, Dak floats the ball into the end zone. Caught by Amari Cooper participating in the 10 toes down challenge for a Cowboys touchdown. Five minutes, five minutes, we still got time. Don't give up now, guys. We can still make a comeback. First and 10, 27 seconds left to play. Dak looking deep towards his left. He's got Cedric Wilson inside the... What you say? What happened to his hands? Tariq Cohen is gonna flip, and this game is over.
Jason Garrett! Your mediocrity knows no bounds. You started 3-0 and and only won three of your last ten, you damn bum! I would rather live my life with AIDS than take a chance on you as my head coach. I got a better chance seeing Barack Obama break up with Michelle, release a sex tape with Melania Trump, than see you lead a team to prosperity. No longer should you reside on the sidelines. The only place you deserve to be is at the end of a Super Smash Bros game because all you do is clap. Jason Garrett, put your motherfucking head back down, you got damn bum the dallas cowboys catching l's on the field and catching l's in the stands chicago bears fans out here giving away more beats by dre and it's not even christmas the cowboys taking more fists than an anal stretching class at a brazzer set why do we suck this month we were supposed to be them boys how about them cowboys <laughs> off from thick to thick he goes into the end zone for another Cowboys touchdown they take a three possession lead it's safe to come out now it's safe to come out now we are by three scores when I tell you it don't matter what we did for all them weeks we back baby we back we that boys they can't stop us we got thick we got thick we got thick and we here we going all the way Eagles you better watch out did you think you was gonna get to see the last ramp touchdown? No, we cut it up the highlights because we still won the game. Now we both 7-7 seven seven Philadelphia. Get ready, next week we gonna bring the deck attack. We gonna make sure Zeke is back. Oh man, we ain't gonna score. Cause we got Dick, we got Zeke. I'm a recouper. Jason Witten, Van Der S. Hopefully he can play. Sean Lee, Tank Lawrence, Jalen Smith. We them boys. We win in the NFC East. And then we go into the Super Bowl. And with this win, next week we'll most likely decide the division between the Eagles and the Cowboys. And Cowboys fans looking at their TVs like... Got no. Buffalo Wild Wings, Josh Allen over the middle. He's got Coleslaw Beasley to move the check. <laughs> what happened to his head? I know they're not in Dallas. That's why he's not playing for the Cowboys. Hey, hey, get out of here. Super Mario was actually born with a micro penis. When he gets the super mushroom, it only works on just the tip as the pass is ricocheted in the air off the fingertips of Coleslaw Beasley. Intercepted by Steven Nelson and returned inside the 20 for the Pittsburgh Steelers. They told you he was trans. That's why we don't want him anymore. Hey, get out of here. Just remember, we did boys and we go into the Super Bowl. I can't stand no more. Within one for the Eagles, Carson Wentz passes much like a shower without washing your lower body. Incomplete. Ha ha ha, you see that? We can make plays on defense. Hey look guys, the Cowboys made a field goal. They cut their deficit to one score. It's only a matter of time before we find the end zone now. No way we're gonna lose to Philly. We're too close. With the season's on the line guys. We the boys. Roth and eight for them boys. Dick takes the snap looking towards the end zone. He's got Michael Gas. Excuse me, bitch. No way. We got you. Not a chance. Not this time. It never happened. <laughs> no, no, it's not over. We still have a dance. Come on, defense. We need one step. Third and two, last chance for the Cowboys. Hand off to Booby Miles Sanders. He breaks out to the left. That's gonna do it. The Cowboys are gonna lose, and the Eagles take the lead in the division. <laughs> you would
come and get the dub. But Carson Wentz is a fucking scrub. Cry, Eagles, cry, go on, bitch. Don't it make you sad about you? Is Drew Brees swing his hips? Aw, oh, shit! You know what that means. Hit the music! But we need the Giants to win. Come on, Giants! Let's go, Giants! Take down the Eagles! Me land up. Then, boys, Dick hands the ball to Zeke. And just look at the blocks. Man's got more blocks than a game of Jenga. Takes one Redskins defender's ankles. Goes into the end zone. Touchdown, Cowboys. 20 to 3 lead. That's good. That's good. But it don't matter. If the Eagles win, somebody shoot the people for the Eagles. I don't care how they lose. We need them to lose. We need the Cowboys to win the division. And then we can go to the playoff and get six wins. Big and Wentz, Philadelphia. Born and raised. Fucking up Cowboys playoff dreams is what we do these days. As Carson Wentz rifles the ball across the field, it's caught. And the Eagles break the tie and take a 10-3 lead. <laughs> <laughs> Stop them! In order, Case Keenum does not care about the Cowboys' playoff hopes as he cut their deficit to 10. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Eli Manning in training. Daniel Jones rolling towards his left, looking towards the end zone. He'd like a golden shower. Tate. Touchdown, Giants. We like pee on our faces. We like even scores in the Meadowlands. I mean, I know you caught the football like that, but damn, you don't need a holder like that the whole time. That's what I'm talking about! Let's go Giants, baby! I mean, I'm still a Cowboys fan at heart, but we got to cheer for the Giants to win. We like golden showers, baby! Golden shower for the win! I wish somebody gave me a golden shower. One, I like gold. Two, I like showers. Put it together. Hey, that sounds like the life. <laughs> if you're good, Santa Claus might give you a golden shower for Christmas. <laughs> Christmas? My man Santa. Back to the land of them boys. Dick takes the snap, looking towards the corner of the end zone. He's got Michael Gallup, who tell the Redskins, hold my nuggets. Suck my dick! In the end zone, touchdown, Cowboys! All right, I'm feeling comfortable again about our game, but what about the Eagles game? Are the Giants taking the lead? What to Meth Life Stadium we go, Boston Tea Party. Michael Scott goes into the end zone, gives the Eagles a touchdown lead. Hand off to Saquad Barkley, removes the butt plug, finds the hole. He's off to the races. They're not going to catch him. Tie game in Meth Life Stadium again. Back to Jerry World we go. Deck takes the snap, looking left. He's got Michael Gallup. Don't ever try to touch him. Look at the balance you kidding me he's much like a vagina underneath the skirt of a muslim you're not gonna touch it he goes into the end zone touchdown cowboys Yee!
win, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Tie game for the Eagles, and we up by three scores. We the boys. We got Dick, yo. We got Zeke, yo. We got Cooper, and we got me, yo. We them boys, yo. Going it all, yo. Going back to the Super Bowl to annoy, y'all. Let's go, baby. They can't stop us now. Austin Tea Party, Michael Scott goes into the end zone. Touchdown, Eagles. Ten-point lead. Things are looking favorable for the NFC East Brown. Back to the land of them boys. Dick takes the snap, looking towards his right. He's got Michael Gallup, who exposed his left testicle on his first score, his right testicle on his second score, and now his entire nutsack. In fact, he's rubbing his gluteal cleft all over the Washington Redskins. But that don't matter! The Giants is losing by 10! Come on! Come on! Thank you for coming to class. Welcome to Social Studies. What was the key event leading up to the Revolutionary War? Well, that was Boston Tea Party Michael Scott, who goes into the end zone for the Eagles' touchdown. They double the deficit for the Giants. And they're going to clinch their trip to the playoffs. God damn, the firing is not stopping. Pat Shermer is out of the job in New York. I wonder if they patted him on the way out out of the door. Uh, uh. All right, all right, I'll stop. Nobody ever told me to stop, but then again, they were dead. And I said, oh my God, I think the Eagles could clinch the NFC East. No! 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 We were supposed to be there, boys. What happened? We were supposed to be super bopper. We killed the Redskins, and then the Giants couldn't take care of business. I should have learned when I was reading the Bible. You could never trust the Giants. It's some bullshit. I cannot believe it. Get Jason Garrett out of here. I had enough of chlamydia clapping as my coach, but it don't matter. Cause next year. When we pay deck, it's a rip! What? Cause we got thick, we got thick! Amari Cooper, Van Der Es, I hope his neck get healthy. Jalen Smith, Tank Lawrence, Byron Jones. Somebody better pay him, make sure he come back. He's actually pretty good at cornerback. They said we're in. I'm not too sure if he's gonna come back next year, but we happy to have the old man on the squad. Tony Romo on commentary. But if he wants to leave the booth, we got an opening and head coach. Michael Irvin as an analyst. Troy Aikman on commentary. We gonna be them boys! We going all the way next year. We going 16 and 0 in the regular season. We also going 4 and 0 in the preseason. That's 20 and 0. We going to win our three playoff games, 23 and 0. And we going to win the Super Bowl for the sixth time to get six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings, six rings. Six rings. <laughs> For the Cowboys, you would join the Giants, Lions, Redskins, Panthers, Cardinals, Buccaneers, Falcons, Bears, Rams, Bengals, Dolphins, Chargers, Browns, Jaguars, Jets, Colts, and Broncos because of your failures to complete an adequate season, your failures to accumulate enough W's to make it to the postseason. Consider your name. Written down the death note because your dreams of making it to the Super Bowl, your dreams of contending for the Lombardi, your dreams of hosting up the Super Bowl trophy has been absolutely dead. There's only one thing left to do. Gotta write their names in the death note. Delete. Delete, 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 del
Fitting when you needed somebody to make a play, you can never trust a representative of the Dallas Cowboys. No, and we lose in the regular season, and then we lose in the Pro Bowl. What's going on, Jalen Smith? He didn't hold it down for the NFC. The NFC in the Trevoni colored zone, Rosetta Stone, Ukrainian motherfucker. As Russell Wilson would connect with Umari Armani Exchange Cooper in the end zone, touchdown NFC. They regained the lead. How about them Cowboys? Good catch, Cooper. Don't worry. Next year, we gonna have all 22 starters on offense and defense elected as starters to the Pro Bowl. But we not gonna have to go because we got a bigger game to play for. Because we starting off 4 and 0 in the preseason. That's 4 and 0. Then we go in 16 0 in the regular season. That's 20 and 0. Then we win in three games in the postseason. That's 23 and 0. And then we go in the Super Bowl. Six rings. Six rings. Six rings. Six rings. Six rings. Six rings. Boy. Ezekiel Elliott looking to go deep. Looks like Fat Albert's in the house because Joe hey, hey. Aiden with the interception. Of course, it'd be a cowboy throwing an interception. It don't matter because Zeke don't play quarterback. We got Dick and he's going to be the highest quarterback in the NFL because we're that boy. And next year, we're going to the Super Bowl. Goddamn Cowboys fans every year with their horse shit. I can't take it anymore.